Welcome to the latest installment of Chord by Chord, the series designed to build your understanding of harmony in the fretboard. In a previous lesson, we went over C major 9. In this lesson, we're going to go over three more major 9 chords, A major 9, E major 9, and F major 9. Now, if you remember, a major 7th chord is built from the 1st, the 3rd, the 5th, and the 7th from a major scale. To make a major 9 chord, you simply add the 9th. Example 1 shows us the notes in an A major 7 chord. The notes are A, C sharp, E, and G sharp. Example 2 shows us the notes in an A major 9 chord. The notes are A, C sharp, E, G sharp, and B. Example 3A shows us how to get to an A major 9 chord from an A major 7th chord using open chords. All you have to do is lift one finger. Example 3B shows us how to get to A major 9 from A major 7 using closed, jazzier voicings. Now moving on to E major 9, example 4 shows us how to get to E major 9 from E major 7 using a couple of voicings in 7th position. Note that you could add the low open E string for a thicker sound. Example 5A shows us how to get to F major 9 from F major 7 using a couple of closed voicings. Here's example 5A. Note that the voicings in example 5A are movable shapes. So what we did is we simply took the voicing from example 3B and moved it down four frets from A to F. Note that example 5B is another example of a movable shape as it's simply the voicing from example 4 moved up one fret to get F major 7. But in this case, we're leaving out the low open E string as that doesn't fit in the chord. You should now know a variety of ways to play A, E, and F major 9 chords. One song that makes use of an F major 9 chord in passing is Sea and Sand by The Who. The girl I love is a perfect dresser Wears every fashion, gets it to the T Heaven's above, I've got to match her She knows just how she wants her man to be Leave it to me Thanks for watching. In the next lesson, we're going to revisit dominant ninth chords.